Tripia today we go all the way to Kisi town. Maze tu mingia tu mtae. Watu wa mandis. Kisi, yeah. <laughs> My producer anasema watu wa mandis. Correct. So today yeah. we have an artist all the way from Kisi. But this is a cool from Tiny. Wewe unajua uko Nairobi. But unaweza kufika Nairobi kuja interview. Mm. Hit us up at Karaoke Live wait for all. Ka kazi yako inaweza tutakuita. So this guy he came all the way from Kisi town mm -hmm. akakuja huku. We had an amazing interview. He goes by the name of Tam Tam Classic. Amekuja na gari ya gani? Mbukinya. Sikuivo, sikuivo. Eh lazima tujue yeye. Amekuja na upa. Unajua upa ya TikTok. Sawa, hebu muulize. Hata tuangalie. Tumwangalie hapo alafu muulize. Ndio hiyo. Facebook page Karaoke Live watu 54 Twitter handle ni @karaoke live watu 54. Amo tupate kwenye social media platform @filinjin @fulimboko. Ama vipi? Right. All right, guys, and like I told you, we have an artist in the house. He's a budding artist all the way from Kisi Town. Na mekuja pa karaoke ku represent wa sawa Kisi. Like, ina jani lete and dizzy, by the way. So, anyway, he goes by the name Tam Tam. Ina jani Tam Tam? Niko Poa. Tam Tam Classic, by the way. Mkwanza tani nge kwa chatu uji introduce. Tell us your names. Ala futo mbio Tam Tam ime toka wabi. Kwa majina yangu ni Tam Tam Classic. Natoka upande wa kisi, yeah. mini mkachi huko, msani mkubo huko kisi. Mm -hmm. yeah. Jina kwa ya usani imetoka wapi, tam tam classic. Sababu unge jita tu tam tam, ama unge jita tu classic, kupa tuka jita tam tam classic. Tuambie kusu jina. Ok, jina tam tam ilitokana na kila ambajo mina patia, na patia kwa mafani. So, nilikuwa yani ngoma zinye, nilikuwa na piga. So wase wakasema, hey ngoma ni tamu, ziju watu watu, ah nikasema, kama wase wa, mafansa wamesema ngoma ni tamu, ah nikasema wache ikuni yo jina, nikuwe tamu tamu ya. Now that makes sense, sani mikisika hivyo na sikena makes sense. Ya putu mbiye difference ya mziki wa Nairobi na mziki wa Kisi, kuna ato fauti gani? Ay, sioni, sioni kama kuna tofauti, sababu mziki inategemea msani mwenye wa na Ako na nini? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we will end the safari ya mziki lini. At what point kwa maisha kondo ulijua we ni msani umeza imba na point gani ulianza? Okay, mi msani nilianza kitambo. So far, by then my father likuwa msani. Alikuwa na imba hizi maroko, roko hizi. So, the time wa rikufa, wase wakasema siji nini, nani atashikire yo nini yake. Nikasema, sini, nini likuwa na talent. Nikasema, kama wase wanasemi eti siji nini nuotu. Nikasema, aja niyanse kwa kuimba. Sa babako nda liku inspire kwanza kuimba? Ya, babangu ndi alini inspire ndi wanika kwa mwana mziki ni kanza kuimba. Oh, nice. So, how far ago? Yu ni kitambo gani? Okay. Ngoma yangu yenye nilirekodi ya kwanza ilikuwa 20 what 2012. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So safari yako kwenye muziki imekwaje? Sababu ni mwana YouTube kuna video tu tatu. Sasa so, lakini kwanza ya 2012 hadi 2019. Um twambie excuse me how was your journey been? Umekwaje? Eh hey, muziki ni ngumu. <laughs> muziki na kwanga ngumu lakini ni kufumilia tu. Yeah. Kufumilia alafu ina ina taking time lakini ni kufumilia. Right. Mm. Sa, ukisema mziki ni ngumu na manisha nini? Kuna changa moto gani ambazo umekumbana nazo along the way? Changa moto ni mingi. Mm -hmm. Kwanza changa mtu kupwa ni pesa. Yeah. Lafu marketing nao ni, ni kazi ngumu kumarketing mziki yeah. yako ndio ikubarike kwa watu. Mm -hmm. Hapo ndi inakuanga sini ni kazi ngumu sana. Right. Yeah. So kutuma marketing, does that mean sai? Sasa now that mziki wako umanza kutoka, umepata manager, umepata mtuwa kukusai, nama bado tu na waki independent gift? Mi si, bado si japata manager, mi na chitegemea. Mi si, na chitegemea. Then, unatafta manager? Nikipata ni sawa, lakini kwa sasa hivi. Sai tuko pati visu, kiwa pati visu, by the way, watu ni wengi, kusema tu unataka manager haya, unambia tu social media wanakutafuta. Ok, sawa, ni sawa, kikuja ni sawa, lakini kwa sasa hivi, sina manager, mina chimaneji, hivo. Alright, so tuongei kusu ngoma yako, ni mwona ukona ngoma katha, first before tuongei kusu your latest song, let's talk about kwa ngwaru. Kuna ngoma nyingi sana hapa Kenya zimetokea, lakini we uka mwakufuka waboda, kidogo tu kenda kwale Tanzania uka sample kwa ngwaru. Kwanza mwona reason geni lipanya ndo sample kwa ngwaru? Najua mziki saa hii, wasani, tseme like hapa nyumbani Kenya, wasani ni wengi sana. 
so kitambo kufanya muziki watu wa kubari yeah. ni nakuanga ngumu so najaribu kukuja na hiyo different idea so nikaona ah nikaona kama kama wa Kenya wanapendanga ngoma za kina diamond watu ni wengi wanatambua diamond yeah. kasi moja ni kuja na idea ya diamond right. at least itaniweka somewhere so ikakuwa tu hivyo na kibaksi ni kikakubalika ni maana you have um, close to 600,000 views on YouTube hiyo ilifanya ufilaji yani umetoa ngoma kidogo kidogo na una two views inaendelea kufanya kama sanio ina fanya how did you feel eh hey, nasikia poa sana <laughs> ndio si kitu ya kawaida yeah. msanii kufanya ngoma na upata hizo view yeah. ah nimependa sana hata namshukuru Mungu yeah yeah All right. Sasa sasa hivi kitu watu wanaongea sasa sasa hii hashtag inaendelea ni hashtag play Kenyan music, right? Alafu wewe umeondoka sample ngoma ya Tanzania sababu uliona itakubalika. What do you think about the current hashtag? Una, una maoni magani kuhusu hiyo hashtag play Kenyan music? Unadhani ma presenter na ma DJ hawa support Kenyan artists ama tupatie tu opinion yako kuhusu hiyo the whole the whole idea. Yenye sasa hii kila mtu anaongelea. <laughs> Hiyo idea unajua mm-hmm. unajua mziki mimi huwa nasemanga mziki ni inategemea nini unini uko nao wewe mwenyewe msanii seme like seme seme kama mi watu na prem seme like hapa nyumbani mimi na prem wasanii hawa wakubwa ukiangalia hawa wasanii wetu wa hapa nyumbani kila mtu unajua anachiona star hawa yeah. wasanii wetu wa wakubwa mm-hmm. watu wa wachipangi hawa wasanii wetu wangekuja pamoja wasem ah hii mtindo wa kina tuseme like wase kama kina diamond wanafanya unajua kina diamond wako pamoja yeah, na unajua watu watu wameshikana ni vingumu ku nini so kila kitu mkishikana muki hivi inakwanga strong so mimi nasema hapa kwetu nyumbani acha wasanii tuchipange tukuje pamoja tushikane alafu pia sisi tukue na idea zetu kama wa Kenya ndio tu tukue na target yetu tu, ni nini tunafaa tufanye kama wasanii wengine huko nje Yeah. And that poses a question by the way guys at home. I want your opinion about this. What's your opinion about the hashtag play Kenyan music? Do hit us up at karaoke live white to five four. That's on Facebook and Twitter and on Instagram at karaoke underscore live white to five four. I'm at feeling Jin. So hit me up and keep, let's keep the conversation going, right? All right. So uko na ngoma mpya. Nimeiona sasa hivi inaitwa Daddy. Chombe kusu Daddy. Daddy may inspire you. Imekuwa inspired na nini? Ngoma dad ngoma dadi niliandika time babangu alikufa ni hiyo ndio idea ikakuja ikasema babangu babangu ameku, amekufa unajua sisi wasanii huwa yani tunafanya ile kitu yani iko ama inaenda kukua so ikasema yeah. kama hii babangu ameenda ikasema aja ni kuje na hii idea kumeki yani kumeki muziki at yeah. least ikue kama yeah. yani nikikumbusho kwangu na watu wengine pia right yeah. Okay. So daddy mechukula vi. Okay, so kwanza daddy mekwa inspired na true story. Tuzi hiyo ni life yako. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's my life. Sasa na bila tu mwanako video hivyo ndo yalitokea ama video umechota kidogo? By the hiyo video video venye iko hivyo hiyo ndio story sasa iko hivyo. Yeah. Sorry about that. Like so umejitahidi na sasa hivi umefika mali umefika. Yeah. So daddy me receive your vipi? Ma fans wako wamechukulia vipi? wa mafani wangu wame bethe mimi nashukuru mafani wangu mm-hmm. wanaendelea kusupport muziki yangu mm-hmm. na nawapenda na right. nawaomba na wasidi kusukuma muziki yangu mm-hmm. at least pia sisi tu tufike somewhere yeah, yeah so. All right, so that's a good thing. At least my fans wako nakubali kazi yako na wewe mwenyewe unaendelea ku grow. So labda uambie watu wenye wanakuona for the first time what are to happen ngoma zako. Kama wanataka kusikiza hawajaona dadi hawajaona hiyo cover ya kuangwa ruu anaitwa wapi? Okay, ngoma zangu zote nimeweka YouTube. Mm-hmm. Okay, ukinisaji tamtam kama tamtam classic kwa social media, YouTube, ni new what? Facebook, mm-hmm. Twitter, Instagram utapata ngoma zangu hapo. Lakini sana sana ni YouTube. YouTube. Nimeweka ngoma zangu tu hapo. Eh, uh, alafu classic ni ile ya K, right? Classic ni ya K, yeah. okay. kama Kiswahili. <laughs> Aya sasa sasa hivi nataka kufanya kitu moja sababu kila msanii akikuja hapa lazima atuimbie. Sasa mimi nataka kuimbe kidogo, labda kwa ngwaru, labda dadi, ngoma yote ambayo unapenda. Unip kidogo tu chorus tu kidogo watu wasikie sauti yako bila kitunguu na nyanya ni nini nini. Tumie tu kidogo wasikie vile ita sound, right? Yeah. Aya. Okay. Ako wapi dadi? Hebu nieleze mami. Alienda wapi dadi? Mbona sielewi mami? 
Ivi hali gani hatarudi lini dadi Ivi hali gani hatarudi lini dadi yeah all right that's amazing that is his latest work it's called daddy and it's available on the youtube at tam tam classic with a k so go search it and support it i told you guys we are all about supporting the local talent we've been supporting kenyan music we've been supporting local talent for the longest time so what you know that support size city is like tambo confine what a karaoke see will let artists upcoming right because uh, most of the time like uh, we bring artists that have never had interviews before and we give them platforms so if you're out there you're an artist and you know you have a good job your work is good we can actually play it on tv or music make sure to hit us up at right to five four channel at feeling zone at karaoke live white to five four we're gonna sample it and if it's worth uh being on tv we'll definitely invite you for the interview but about now let's this um Unaambia some sani wa Kenya now that you're talking about Kenyan music ni nani wazata kufanya naye kazi sasa hivi hapa Kenya ama nani anafanga pia ameinspire kidogo utambie nani ameinspire na nani wazata kufanya naye kazi moving forward Okay hapa Kenya wasani wa Kenya ni wengi Okay napanga Okay naendelea na kutafuta nikipata msanii wa Kenya wa mkubwa hivi nitafanya naye kazi of which is I see Juni nani yeah <laughs> but since nani kijitokeza utakubali na nani amekuinspire na wewe nani ameku nani ukiwa mdogo like okay apart from your dad because of sababu ulikuwa umeniambia kidogo dako ndo alikuwa anaimba na ulikuwa na look up to him nani mwingine akiu sanii alikuwa anakuinspire hapa Kenya okay nikipata mse kama utile nitafanya naye kazi yeah yeah so utso nitafanya naye kazi na since kitafanya naye kazi yeah nice that's awesome all right so just real quick um uko na any project unafanyia kazi ama kuna kitu yote unataka kuambia ma fans wako kabla to wrap up okay niko na project mpya saa hii yenye nimefanya audio but yeah. sijafanya video but, but next week hivi nitafanya nita video nita release video nitawaambia kama ma fans wangu yeah nitaipata tu. Ah that's nice. Na unajua naweza kuja ku drop hapa. Ndio mimi ndiko na video unarudi tu hapa. Hapa hapa tu. Eh to receive unakuja una drop hapa hivi unaambia ma fans oh la Tam Tam Classic has a new song. There you go. All right so auna shout outs kuna watu wanataka kusalimia nini nini kule nyumbani kabla tu ndoke. Okay, naweza salimia my mom and my brothers wangu. Yeah. Eh yeah. Okay. Sawa sawa. All right, thank you for coming. But oh, maybe real quick social media handles. Remind guys your social media handles. Love to appreciate. So sho watu wanakutoa wapi kwenye mtandao ni kama kuna mtu amekuona labda ulisema unataka manager sasa ukiwa na manager nataka kukufikia na kufikia VP mafans wako wanakutoa wapi mtandao ni? Wani follow Twitter, mm-hmm. mm, Instagram niko, alafu Facebook niko. Kitu tu taandika ni tamtam classic. Oh. Unajileta tu, unajileta tu. <laughs>